Okay, so the first thing you want to do is open a new notepad window and you want to type this. Opening bracket, opening speech mark, and then um, your message will go here. Now, one thing that I often forget, you've got to put the closing speech marks on the other end, and you do a space, and then a comma, and um, I just want the OK button. And so you do another comma after that, another space, and then opening speech marks. Yeah. And then your closing speech marks and closing bracket. And so when you go to save it, um, you want to call it anything you want so I'm just going to go db script and you want to have the file extension as .vbs and make sure that the file type is changed from text document to all files and then save it. Now the icon will come up like that and uh, when you double click on it up like this. Your title will go here, your message will go here. And to edit that, you right click on it and click edit. And it opens up the notepad window. And you, you can see how that kind of works. Your message will go here because this bit of text. And your title will go here because this bit of text. So, um, now you can have different buttons. This bit in here, which is the buttons in the icon. Here's a list. This is a list of the uh, buttons, what they equal, and their message icons. Uh, that list is on my website though, so you can just look at it on there. Um, Say I wanted to have the um, OK button plus the critical message icon. I could do that, and I could say um, this has a critical message icon, and I could say. For the title, I could go critical message test. And just click, click on that. And then you click out and go save. And then when you open it, it comes up like that. And it does the noise, the ding for the critical message button. And, uh, yeah, you can um, do lots of different things with the DB scripts. Honestly, I don't know why they're here, why you can make them, but they're lots of fun for pranks and stuff. And I'll make a video to show you how to prank a friend or someone with one of these. And so, yeah. For more information, I've got in the programming page on my website information about DB scripts. And if you want to know anything else, just contact me on my website. Okay, thanks for watching.